sure you take notes when you're watching the video. Best to learn. If you need to pause it, you need to pause it again. If you need to rewind, you can rewind and watch the video again. What you're going to realize is you the next class when we do advanced training. Okay, so let's take a look at this problem here. I want you to solve for x. What is x? x is in degree. And then play the video and you can see how I did it. All right, first what do we know? We know b, angle b, and angle c. How do we find angle a? It all equals 180. y equals mx plus b. The m stands for what? The m stands for the slope. And the b stands for the y-intercept. You guys have seen this many times. If you know this, you'll be fine. That b equals and then I can rewrite everything. I have the m and the b. y equals negative 2x plus b plus 4 is the final equation. On and on forever. Don't forget that we can label it line ab, or I can just say line l, or I can put ab and make sure I put it on top. Make sure you have those. Wow, there's lots of combinations out there, huh? Well, in this lesson, we're just going to be combining translations, reflections, and rotations. And we might take some point or an object, and we might translate it up or down, or right or left. We might then rotate it around the point, to then even reflect it over a line. But let me give you...